Hi everyone, welcome to another tutorial. Today, I'm going to show you how to create a simple logo animation in Adobe After Effects. This is perfect for beginners, so if you're just starting your animation journey, this video is for you. First, let's create a new composition. I've already prepared a Netflix logo, which I'll drag into the project. Now, by using the S shortcut, we can scale it down, that is, change its size. I'll make a pre-composition of the logo so that later it will be easier to swap it for any other. Next, we'll create a circle. We don't need stroke so I turn it off and adding fill can be white. Make sure the layer is properly named. Using the alignment tools, we'll ensure the shape is perfectly centered on the screen. Now, let's move on to the drop animation. Open the position parameter and create a simple falling animation. Add a keyframe at this point. The circle needs to fall from the top, so we position it at the bottom. Next, we'll add an animated line attached to the circle. We'll use the pen tool for this. In properties, remove the fill and set the stroke, adjusting its thickness and color. To animate the line, go to the Add tab and select Trim Paths. By changing these, we can make the line appear to be drawn. If you want to reverse the direction of the line, go into Shape, next to Path 1, and reverse the drawing direction. Now, using the Start parameter, the line will draw from the top. Once the ball has fallen, set the value to 100%. After the ball falls, it needs to bounce back up. We'll adjust the position. And then set it to fall back down again. As the ball moves up, the line must disappear. So we create an animation on start, setting the final keyframe to 0%. We also want the logo to appear as the circle falls, we can move it on the timeline using the mouse or the shortcut Alt plus left square bracket. The circle will disappear at the same time the logo appears, so we'll trim the layer using Alt plus right square bracket. I want the circle to grow larger. So let's go into the parameters and choose size. We'll create an animation where, at the bottom, the circle increases in size slightly. When it rises, the size remains the same. But when it falls again, it enlarges even more. If the circle is falling too quickly, select the layer, press U on the keyboard, and move the keyframes slightly to the right. Select all the keyframes and apply Easy Ease by pressing F9, which will make the animation smoother. Finally, let's add a slight animation to the logo. First, move it up the timeline, then, using the position parameter, create an animation. Move the logo slightly upwards. Apply Easy Ease and adjust the motion speed in the graph editor. We want the movement to be fastest at the beginning. Now the animation looks good. We can also add motion blur. The animation is done. 
Don't forget to like and subscribe, and there will be more tutorials coming soon. Take care, see you next time.